shall work, shall work, shall work. Who are we? We're the Hebrew Israelite man. We come in week in and week out to come prophesy the dog fall at this place, man. man. Right. right! Because, yo, we out here to wake up our brothers and sisters. Right. We let them know that they are the true biblical Israelite. That's right! The scripture, man. Right? We don't throw that joke. We are going to sound the trumpet. Because when we come to sound the trumpet, a lot of time, man. Right! And it go. This is Esau kingdom going down. Right. And right. Jacob kingdom rising. Right. Four corner I heard. Right. Right. We now left nowhere. East, west, north, and south. The Israelites taking over. That's right. And we have nothing to fear. Because what? We have Yahweh Shimei Shai in the midst of us. And we don't further do. We are going to glorify the heavenly father with a mighty Hebrew show. And we say what? Call the other house. Hashem, Yahu Shai, Hashem, Rakat Hadash, Rakat Hayahawa, Rakat Hayahu Shai, Rakat Hayahawa, Rakat Hayahu Shai, and one with us, Shalom, Wah, 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 Rise Israel, and yo, we have a call of a mighty, a mighty, mighty, right captain, that's a quad. Shalom, Shalom. We are the Hebrew Israelite and we're coming to prophesy the downfall of this kingdom and raise up our people out of the dust. That's right! Help. We have to help him. Read on. 
by the Holy Ghost. Right. By love and praise. By love and praise. That's why we come out here. We love to come out here and praise our Heavenly Father. We done. By the word of truth. By the what? By the word of truth. Right. Hold that there. Get me. Somebody get me. So, so uh, and he says, and truth, because the righteousness is the truth. Psalms 119, verse 142. Thy righteousness is an everlasting righteousness. Thy what? Thy, Thy righteousness, righteousness is, is an everlasting righteousness. righteousness. Thy what? Thy, Thy righteousness, righteousness is an everlasting righteousness. Read. And thy law is thy truth. The what? And thy law is thy truth. The what? And thy law is thy truth. So the law is the truth. Keeping the laws is the truth of the Heavenly Father. That's right. That's right. why I said keep the truth. Read on. By the power of Yahweh. By the armor of righteousness. By the armor of what? By the, By the armor, armor of righteousness. righteousness. By the armor of righteousness. That's the Lord's. If you just read that in Psalms 119 and 142. The armor of righteousness. Read on. On the right hand and on the left. Right. So you've got to be righteous either way you go. You've got to be righteous either way. Read on. By honor. Right. That is honor. By evil, report and good report. Right. So everything you got to be reverencing the, old, the Heavenly Father. Right. Always, continually, night and day, meditate in the scriptures. Hand. As deceivers and yet true. Read. As unknown and yet well known. Read. As dying and behold we live. Right. As chastising and not killed. Right. Because we're chastised every day and we're not killed. Because that's the mercy that the Lord is, is showing to the Israelites. That's right. We're through plenty of affliction and he's showing us mercy still. Come on. Read on. That's horrible. Yet always rejoicing. Right. It's, it's the sorrow out here. Bringing sorrows. But we're going to rejoice in the Heavenly Father. We're going to keep up his works. That's and right. And continually and rejoice and reverence him morning, noon and night. Right. Read on. That's cool. You're making many rich. Right. So plenty of us is poor, but we're rich in spirit. We're rich in the words of the Heavenly Father. We're getting washed and dip up in the scriptures. Washing in the word. Read on. As having nothing and yet possessing all things. Right. We don't have nothing. But we are going to possess everything because it was promised unto us. That's right. So we don't have to worry. Psalms 111, verse 10. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. The what? The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. You see, the fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom, read. A good understanding as all men that do this commandments. Right. So you're going to get your good understanding if you keep the commandments. If you don't keep the commandments, you're not going to understand the scriptures. Because you don't know what's going on in them. So you've got to get good understanding. Then you can know what's going on in the scriptures. Because the Lord won't work with you if you just don't do nothing. You're still out in the world and doing your wickedness. His praises endure forever. For how long? Forever. For how long? Forever. forever. For his praises endure forever. Always. This is the book of John, chapter 12, verse 26. If any man serve me, let him follow me. And where I am, there shall also my servant be. Right. If any man serve me, him will my father honor. Right. So he said, we have to serve the Lord, and there we be in the midst of us. As I said, when two or three are gathered, there is in the midst of us. Right. There's more than that gathering right now. So I'm there right. Yes, so we that's, right. that's right. Always. That's why we have to praise him continually. This is the book of Psalms, chapter 119 and 142. Thy righteousness is everlasting. Righteous of the Lord. Righteousness and the Lord is true. Right. Righteousness and the Lord.
law Shalom. is the truth that should be just spread in Psalms 119. This is Psalms chapter 119, verse 140. Thy word is very pure, therefore set thy servant is loved. I am a small and despised, yet right. you in not I forget thy precepts. Right, so we can't forget the precepts. That's we right. can't remember them. Keep them in our minds and our hearts. That's right. Continually. Then in the scriptures, that's why my brother always said in our quotes on our, on, on, on our, our chat, pray, fast, repeat. You gotta keep doing that and study to be approved. Keep learning. Keep right. learning to the scriptures. Don't be idle in at home on your Instagram and Twitter and, and, and TikTok. Get in the scriptures so that you know what's going on because it says, a good understanding of he that keep the commandments. The Lord never command us to go on TikTok and stay there all day. Right. The Lord never command us to be on Instagram. I'm finding that and it's a distraction. That's right. That's why it says we're not ignorant to certain devices. But that's the devices that he give us to distract us and keep us from the heavenly father. And they're doing a good job on our young people. That's right. This is Isaiah chapter 41 verse 10. Fear thou not, for I am with thee. What? Fear thou not, for I am with thee. He's not dismayed, for I am thy power. He's our what? But I am thy power. He's our what? I am thy power. He's our power. That's right. He's our power on the earth. Because we ain't got no power. We ain't got no military. But he's our power if we keep the commandments. Without do nothing. Just we have the best power in the world. Right, right. No one can beat him. He's right. never lost a battle right. yet. Sister, come here to work. I will strengthen thee. Yea, I will help thee. Yea, I will hold thee with the right hand of my righteousness. Right, he's going to hold us with the right hand of his righteousness. That's right. That's why we are on the right side and not the left. Make the other nation them stay up on the left. Heat. We're staying on the right. That's right. We're not moving off of that position. Heat. Right. Read on. Behold, all day that were incensed against thee shall be ashamed and confounded. And what? And confounded. Oh, yeah. That's why when we, when we, when yesterday, yesterday, my brother, tell Esau that she's wasted away. She was confounded. She didn't know what to do. Right. She just have run up her mouth right. and confound her. She right. didn't go about her business. Right. Because the Lord said we will confound them with the word. She don't even know what's going on. She's chatting up her mouth. She don't know the scriptures. But it's really saying, Brother, where you from? Jacob of my love, where you from? Israel of my hate. Where are you from? Come here, come here. You see? There shall be as nothing. You see how the spirit works. <laughs> and, and they that strive with thee shall perish. But they what? And, and they, they that strive with thee shall perish. See, they that strive with us shall perish. He just said, he's our power. And he's telling you, keeping the statutes and the people that come against us shall perish. Right. Read on. Verse 12. Thou shalt seek them and shall not find them. Right. Even them that contended with thee. Right. So you know, I'm going to see them soon. You're going to see the people and you're not going to find them. Those that contended with us. Those that come against us. Those that rise up against us when we're not doing nothing but praising the Heavenly Father and telling them that they're the devil that the Bible speak of. That's right. They that war against thee shall be as nothing. As what? Shall be as nothing. As what? As nothing. That's why he said they're wasting away because they've done nothing already. They're going to be as nothing. Like they never existed. We don't. And as a thing of naught. As a, as a thing of what? And as, as a, a thing, thing of, of naught. Not, nothing. He's repeating it. And that's yeah. why he called them wasted away. Give them that name. Esau wasted away. We don't. For I the Lord Jehovah will hold thy right hand, saying unto thee, Fear not, I will help thee. Fear not, thou worm Jacob and ye men of Israel. I will help thee, saith the Lord. Right. Ye men of Jacob, I will help thee, saith the Lord. 
The man never said that. The man never said he's going to help us. And the Lord said, I'm going to help with. Right. The right. Lord will make heaven and earth. Right. Everybody said it's their God. It's not their God. Right. It's only the God of the Israelites. That's it's right. The scripture that says, You own them by no heaven of all the families of the earth. And the Lord called us one, that one Jacob. Right. So we're small. Right. Don't worry about that. Exactly. So we call him us when what so the other nation. Right, right, right. Yeah. This is the book of St. John, chapter 13, verse 33, and it reads, Little children, yet a little while, I am with you. Right, the children, yet a little while, he said he's with us. So that's waiting patiently, but we know right. that the Heavenly Father is continually with us. Read on. Yeah, shall see me, and as I said unto the Jews, whether I go, you cannot, you cannot come. So now I say to you, a new commandment I give it unto you, that you love one another as I have loved you, right. that you also love one another. Right. So we're going to love ourselves and love one another as we love ourselves as a Mashiach has loved us. Right. Because he's the one that's given us the commandments and the, the, the example that we must follow. Right. Everything that he done was an example to the Israelites. Loving our brothers as we love ourselves. Reverencing the Heavenly Father and know that he's the head of everything. Right. This is Amos chapter 3 and verse 2. You, own, you only have I known. You what? You, you only, only have I known. You what? You only have I known. You only have I known. Of all the families of the earth. Right. You only have I known of all the families of the earth. So he made 18 nations and he chose us. And he said, out of all of them, it's us that you only know. Freedom. I will punish you for your enemies. Therefore, he will punish, punish us for all our iniquities because that is why we're the only one who seems like we're going through trials and tribulation That's everybody right. else is okay they have the money they have the media they have the top notch of the uh, not realizing that the lord has a turn it back from the right way right so i try to assassinate the truth right they're trying to assassinate the truth and kill it off but we're coming right. back to bring back the truth in the earth we're going to raise up the people and let them know that they are the true people of the book. That's right. And we're not on the bottom. We're going to be on the top. The Lord has always made us to be at the top and come to not live no bigger life. Good. Right. Isaiah 3, verse 17. But Israel shall be saved. But Israel shall be saved in the Lord. See, can you hear With a what? 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 And he's not going to turn away and cast us up or forsake us. Right. Ah. Is, is with the Israelites. That's right. That's why we got to realize how much the Heavenly Father loves us. Because he said, I will never forsake you. Right. The only time we get forsaken is when we go off. Right. That's right. We can't blame nobody but ourselves. That's, That's right. We gave commandments and we chose not to follow it. That's so right. So when we're going through trials, tribulation and affliction, we bring it for ourselves. That's right. right. He has said, we have sold ourselves. We shall not be ashamed or confounded. So we shall never be ashamed or confounded. Right. Because we've got the scriptures with us. And the Lord never made things to confound us in there. We know that the Lord is with us. We believe that. We understand that. And we reverence him all the time because we know that he's with us. Right. And the Lord don't lie. You know, take back to him. When he says something, it comes to pass. World without end. What? World without end. What? World without end. What? World without end. It's a world without end. The internet world is not going to end. That's right. It's 
just like the angel of days. He's, he's not going to die. And where his people and his world is not going to end. Jeremiah chapter 46 and verse 27. But fear not thou, O my servant Jacob, and be not dismayed, O Israel. For behold, I will say to thee from afar off, as I see from the land of that, their captivity, and Jacob shall return, and be in rest and at ease, and none of them shall face him and bring. This is Jeremiah chapter 46 and verse 27. But fear not thou, O my servant Jacob, right. and be not dismayed, O Gabriel. Right, so we, have, we can't make nobody make us dismayed. Because the Lord has told us, fear not, and be not dismayed of no folly out here. Right. Don't make nothing make us dismayed. That's right. Because we have to back that aside. That's right. You know. For behold, I will save thee from afar off. Right, the Lord is going to save us from afar off. That's right. So no matter which part in there, you might go see it with from afar off. And nobody's got that. Only right. the Israelites have that. Right. Read on. And I see from the land of their, of their captivity. Right. And you see from the land of our captivity. We're still in captivity now. Dude, and he's watching everything. That's right. Read on. And Jacob shall return and be at rest and at ease. And what? And, and Jacob shall return and at rest and at ease. So we're looking for a rest and at ease. One day, we're going to get that. The right. Lord has said it, so he's not going to turn back from that. Right. And I said, he don't tell lie, and he don't take back, Lord. That's right. Read on. And I shall make him afraid. And what? And I shall, shall make, make him afraid. afraid. Nobody but make the Israelite afraid. That's, That's right. right. They can push up their face. They can say what they want. We're not afraid. The Lord never put, give us the spirit of fear. That's right. We're going to be bold out here as lions. Telling them that they're the devil. Yes. Right. 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 Fear thou not, O gate of my servant here the Lord, for I am with thee. Right, he's with us. Son of fear nothing. Nobody can test the Lord. Right, right, and he's right. telling us, don't fear, because he's with us. Right. So what we have to be scared for? When we have to tell them that they're the devil, don't worry about that. Because right. he right. said that's what they are. That's right. Don't worry about Moab. That's what he is. That's he's right. like nothing. Look, the test of you, the you, can't, you can't make this up, man. Right. You can't just say all the loud words. You just bring right. them, come. God. <laughs> he said he will make a full end of all the nations. So that's why he said they're nothing. No business now, then. He's going to make a full end of them. And they're going to know their position when we get back our right for rulership. They're going to bow to the Israelites. Right. We don't have to force them. And if they don't, we, get it, we, get, we use the red of iron. We brought them in pieces. Right. You know? But I have driven me. Right. But I will not make a full end of me. Right. But correct me in measure. Right. So he said he's not going to make a full end of us. That's why he said he's going to save a remnant. And two friends are going to come up, and one friend is going to be here. He's not going to make an end of us. He's right. punishing us right. and showing us that. Don't follow these people because man can't help you. Right. Only the Heavenly Father can help the Israelites. Right. That's why right. follow these devils that want to kill us up and persecute us and put right. us under subjection. That's not happening no more. That's why we're out here raising up the people then to tell them, Come away from the wickedness of this world. Right. Don't do nothing. There's no profit in it. You know. Yeah, will I not leave thee? Yes. Holy unpunished. Will he? Say that again. Yet, will I not leave thee holy unpunished? Right. So he's not going to leave us holy unpunished. So we're going to get payment for the wickedness right. that we have done. Right. But he still promised us the kingdom. So that's like a father love his child. We're going to correct him and not suffer him to be destroyed. That's right. I love him. Let's read the chapter 5 verse 10. But the God of all grace, who has called us unto his eternal glory, by Yahweh Shai. Right, the God of our grace, 
has called us unto his eternal glory. By Yahweh shall his son. Lord. Read on. After that ye have suffered a while. Right. He said we have suffered a while. But we're suffering because of the things that we've done. But he says suffer a while. Read on. Make you perfect. Establish. Straighten. And settle you. Right. So he's going to make us perfect again. And he's going to strengthen us and settle us. Read on. To him be glory and dominion forever and ever. Right. So to him be glory and dominion forever and ever. So that's what we're going to have dominion forever. We're going to rule the place and get back our right for rulership on the earth. But the people that are walking up and down and not realizing how proud we are. We're not weak out here. But the Lord is with us. He's our power. We're not weak people. We never have been. First Peter 5 and 6. Humble yourself, therefore, under the mighty hand of your hour. Right. Humble yourself, therefore, under the mighty hand of your hour. That's right. Right. Right? That is a mighty hand. That's why we're powerful, man. But we don't realize it. We right. walk down, walking around, wishy washy and take. Right. We're right. power yeah. house on the earth. Right. Everybody better believe that. Oh. We're the real power. Right. We're the powerhouse. Right. That he may exalt you in due time. What? Right. That he may exalt you in due time. What? That he may exalt you in due time. We're going to get exalted in due time. So all our people walking up and down dismayed and astonished. We're going to get exalted. We're going to come up off of the bottom. We're going to rise up above all these nations. That's right. So that's what it means. Exalt us. Make us higher than everybody else. But he said, we are the top echelon of the earth. But we don't believe that. But if you pick up the Bible, it tells you, right. all you out, that we're above all nations. All nations is supposed to be under subjection under us. Trap right. them under feet. Casting all your care upon him. What? Casting all, all your care, care upon him. him. Hold that there. Psalms 55 and 22. Casting all your care upon him. That's what he's told us to do. No worry about no bills. No worry about woman. No worry about piano. No worry about nothing. Right. Cast all your cares upon the Lord. Right? That's right. what he's telling us to do. Right. This is Psalm 55 and 22. Cast thy burden upon the Lord. What? Cast thy burden upon the Lord. Right? And he shall sustain thee. And he shall walk. And he shall sustain thee. So he says, that's much enough with that. He shall sustain thee. No worry about nothing. Especially if you're keeping the commandments. All people them down in Jamaica, all of them not keeping the commandment, but they're eating every day. That's because they're children of Israel. It, he, he set them in a place. They can go pick mango, they right. can go pick breadfruit, right. they can go pick ackee, right. so they now got hunger, right. that's what the Lord has done for the children of Israel, no matter what right. trouble and strife we're going to, he's always going to provide, right. Right. cast your burden upon the Lord and he shall sustain you, right. but our people them down there don't know that, they think they're eating every day, because they're of themselves, they are teeth a little thing out of the tree, the Lord put it there for Uno. Right. Right. Putting that teeth in it. Right. Because it belongs to Uno. He done. He shall never suffer the righteous to be moved. He shall what? He, he shall, shall never, never suffer, suffer the righteous to be moved. He shall never suffer us to be moved. We're the righteous. We're the ones that's keeping his charge. Right. And doing his will. He's called us the children of Israel, the righteous people. So we right. we're some people say I'm righteous. You're not righteous. You're wicked. Read on. 